Hey everybody, Pokemon Giant here, and today I'm going to talk about some cards that I think you should pick up while the prices are still low, and I think these are going to do great for the future. Let's get started. And they come from VMAX Climax, and these are the Trainer Gallery, uh, I would say the VMAX versions more specifically. These cards are beautiful, they look great on display, they're still affordable, and these cards are in the English sets of Brilliant Stars, Astral Radiance, Lost Origin, and Silver Tempest. And here on uh, Pokedata.io, I'm just showing you the layout of the VMAX Climax because it's all in one go. And I have uh, another spreadsheet, well, websites that I will show you the English cards uh, variants and what they are doing. So as you can see, VMAX Climax has a lot of beautiful training gallery cards. And I... <laughs> You can't go wrong with any of these cards in my opinion. I know some are worth more, some are worth less, but overall in the future, some of these may pop off more than others and only time will tell. So the things that pop up to me are the Mimikyu VMAX, the Umbreon VMAX, the Pikachu VMAX, the Sylveon VMAX, um, and the Rayquaza VMAX. Oh, let's go. Uh, the Urshifu VMAX as well. The Blaziken VMAX. No. The Duraludon. Yeah. Again, that's in my opinion. Yeah. The Rapid Strike Urshifu. Yeah. This is cool too. Orbital. I've seen this in person. I should have grabbed it when I when I can. I could can. <laughs> and the Corganite VMAX. So, you know, most of the uh, Sword and Shield sets, they have been. Alt arts, you know, here are the uh, Sin Sin Scores VMAX. And these, the cards that I mentioned, are textured cards, beautiful cards on display and in person. You know, very, very beautiful looking cards. And the Mimikyu VMAX is popular, the Umbreon VMAX is popular, but the Sylveon VMAX, you know, that thing has a sparkle. Like, you put it on your desk or on your display. It is going to shine. Pikachu VMAX. Red and Pikachu VMAX, to be more specific. <laughs> it is going to do great. And this could potentially, potentially be the last card of, or you could say Ash and Red or, or whatever it is, you know, for this kind of a combo. Because in the, in the anime, there's no longer Ash and Pikachu. And even this card. And this Rayquaza VMAX is just a beautiful card. I have it. I picked up the Rayquaza VMAX. I picked up the Pikachu VMAX. And I've picked up... Um, oh, where, where is it? Where, oh, yeah, here. Eternica's VMAX. I need to pick up all of the others because they are so beautiful. So let's go to the English side right here. And you can see the prices are not bad. You know, you could get a good, a pretty good centering one. 40 bucks you know and here's a best offer accepted let's look a little closely at this one oh a little chip on that top left you know of course you can ask for more pictures and yeah, the little dot on the bottom right left but it's a beautiful card you know it looks in fairly good shape so that's what i mean like i think this will be good to have for the future. You know, you could pick up maybe three, right? You, you don't think this is going to sell in the future? I think it will. You know, keep it in good shape, send it to be graded. You know, keep it for the long haul. Keep it for yourself. Give it to a friend. Do whatever you want. But I don't think collectors are going to look away at this card. Like, just look at this in the PSA 10. $104. You get the best offer accepted. That's that's pretty cool. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna say this right now. I like this card better than the Rayquaza VMAX from uh, Evolving Skies. I'm sorry, I, I, it, that card is cool. I have seen it in person, but oh man, it's just, man, this card and the trainer in person, this is a beautiful card. That red, it pops out really well. You got the trainer, look, look like a badass, boom. Come on. That doesn't look hot. Man, please. <laughs> and it's not for five, seventy-five dollars. Oh, okay, so a hundred dollar card. CGC ten. 
PSA 10, $80. And you can get a best offer accepted. That's not bad. That is not bad. So I think that the time to get these are now. I know there was a reprint of Lost Origin and Silver Tempest, but um, I, I think that that might be it. Again, I think, I'm pretty sure it might be it. New Era, I know you can still print things. I know things are still in rotation, but I don't know, you know? I don't know. Okay, so it's been it's been pretty healthy, staying around the the same price. Okay, good. Let's check out Sylveon. The, the sparkle is just wow. Imagine that on your desk. A nice conversation piece. A nice uh piece that would just bring people and draw people near it. Just want to look at it, talk to it, talk about it. And this is not even like the best, uh, you know, picture quality. So that's what I'm saying, like with these uh, Trainer Gallery VMAX cards, um, again, even the other ones, they're fine, but today we're talking about the VMAX. I think you're gonna do fine. I think these are gonna be sought after in the future. And here you got 9.5 from CGC, 45 bucks. And you can even get a best offer accepted for this one as well. Okay, PSA 10, 70 bucks. Buy it now. Yeah, like, oh dude. Ma'am, boy, girl, man, woman, <laughs> pick up these cards. Pick up this card. Pick up these cards. I think you cannot go wrong. You don't gotta buy them graded. You could buy them raw. You know, just check out the centering on different ones until you find the ones you like. Ask sellers for pictures of front and back, and ask them for detailed pictures of front and back. Because these prices are, are are great, and you see what they're going for in the PSA 10. Uh, what's this one? PSA 10. Okay, eighty dollars. There's a Beckett eight. Fifty dollars. Best offer accepted. Nice. Okay, fifty bucks for a CGC nine point five. No raw fourteen twelve. So you could get a couple of these raw, and guess what? I think you're you're not going to be hurting at all. Oh, look at this. $53, PSA 10, is that the cheapest one? The PSA 10. Yeah, ooh, see? Yeah, I, and they got 124 results. So, you know, they're, you know, they're out there, but not a lot. Again, I just do it by now. All those things would be a little bit more, but some could be auction. You could, you could probably snap a few auctions. I think this looks better than, <laughs> but it's going to be Max Alt Art. But that is just me. I like this one. Uh, I like the other one too. Don't get me wrong. But I just, I just love how May is grabbing on for her dear life. <laughs> very beautiful card. A very funny card. And just the sky and like the blue and the texture on it and the colors is just eye popping. Okay, decent centering, I guess. It's a little bit thicker on the left by a little though than the right. Eh, almost look the same. The bottom looks a little bit thin, but yeah, we gotta check on check it out on the back. Oh, they don't have a back picture. Oh no, gotta have a back picture, people. <laughs> but again, you just ask the seller. As I conclude this video, I am definitely gonna pick up the rest, and I think that you guys and girls should do the same. You know, do what you want to do, of course. You know, I'm not giving you financial advice. I'm giving you my opinion. I'm not a financial advisor. But I think these cards are going to do great in the future. They look great. They're affordable right now. And we've seen the trend for tag team cards. Let me know what you guys think down below. I want to say I love you guys so much. It means a lot to me that you guys watch these videos. I want your opinion. Are you going to pick up any of these? Do you have any of these in your collection? Um, what do you think about these cards? Do you think that they will go up in value? Do you think they will stay the same? Please leave a like, comment, subscribe. Take life one day at a time. Just know that you're loving God loves you. Pokemon John out. Bye.